Well, as the RPI pep band plays, we are back here on ESPN Plus second intermission at Houston Fieldhouse for all RPI and Colgate in the Big Red Freakout. Back here inside the broadcast booth, Dan Ball with you, and we're talking student government. We have two representatives of the RPI Student Union here, president of the union, Pat Phillips, as well as the Grand Marshals and Minor. Guys, thanks for joining us. How are you? Good, good. How are you, Ben? Doing pretty good. Now, the, the tragedy of this interview for the day start is that they still had some of the best headwear in the building, but we couldn't fit it under the headset, so we had to keep that aside either way. But regardless, thank you guys so much for the time today. Let's talk about both of your roles in the both of you. We can start with you, but also what do you the importance of the student So I'm the Grand Marshal. Um, we do mainly student advocacy, so any projects on campus. Um, we've brought prices down for textbook access codes. We've got composting bins for community access on campus. Wow. And a whole lot of projects that students are passionate about, we work on in the Student Senate. Well, uh, that is, it's fantastic. And, and you guys are, are, are two of the best and brightest when it comes to, to moving RPI forward. So thank you for what you do and what your organizations do first and foremost. Let's talk about the future. What are you expecting here in 2024? Any events and, and projects we can expect to work? The playhouse um, okay. yeah. being um, reconstructed after it um, had no um, right now our biggest project is on uh, pedestrian safety initiatives. Uh, okay. So we're hoping to see some infrastructural changes within the next year or two. Uh, those kind of things can take pretty long, but we're hoping to see <laughs> some changes in the near future. There you go, there you go. Ma making progress as we go, absolutely. But we were talking a bit before, so uh, before we let you guys go, <laughs> tell us about uh, about you. What are you studying and what is the, the future kind of look like? Yeah, so I'm a senior biomedical senior student. I am also a second semester MBA student and with a concentration in life sciences and entrepreneurship. Uh, so those are some of the things that I'm doing here. So I'm a senior aeronautical and mechanical engineer. Um, and next year I'm going to Johns Hopkins to start my PhD in mechanical engineering. All right, very nice. Well, congratulations to, to both of you for that. And uh, last thing, how great is it to be here uh, Be here at the freakout with uh, 4,000 odd uh, of the, of the uh, closest members of the engineer family? It's really cool, really great to see everyone here, especially if we, like, you know, get a pool and everyone's <laughs> moving the towel. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's been a great game. Yeah. Really awesome to be here and so much energy. We're, uh, we're, we're hoping that that energy can continue. It was a great second period, so you, you guys were, uh, were treated to one in that, that middle 20. But uh, again, we, we really appreciate the time. Thank you both for joining us and, uh, and best of luck here in 2020. Thank you for having us. Uh, again, representatives from the RPI Student Union, uh, President of the Union, Cat Phillips, Grand Marshal, Ben Viner as well. Wanted to make sure we got the, the positions right because what these two do for the university is, is something that cannot be understated. So uh, with that being said, we are at the end of two periods here at Houston Fieldhouse for all RPI and Colgate. we got a good one on hand here tonight. These two will be in the stands watching it. We'll be in the booth calling it for you. We'll take a break here on ESPN+. Plus. And be back with more right after this. You are watching Engineers Hockey right here on ESPN+. Plus.